Ten Great Late Forties Films by the Library of Congress Copyright Office. This is a LibriVox recording. All LibriVox recordings are in the public domain. For more information, or to volunteer, please visit LibriVox.org. Reading by Bologna Times Ten Great Films from the Late 1940s Adam's Rib Lowe's, Incorporated Copyright 1949 101 minutes sound black and white 35 millimeter an MGM picture summary a marital comedy on opposing sides in a bitter court battle a district attorney and his lawyer wife match wits on equal rights for women credits producer Lawrence Weingarten director George Cuker screenplay Ruth Gordon Garson Kanan Music Miklos Rosa Film Editor George Bomler Cast Spencer Tracy Catherine Hepburn Judy Holliday Tom Ewell David Wayne Lowe's Incorporated November forty nine LP two six one five Beauty and the Beast La Belle et la Bête Andre Pauvet, France, nineteen forty six, released in the US by Lopère Films Incorporated, nineteen forty seven. Ninety minutes, sound, black and white, thirty five millimeter, in French with English titles, based on the tale by Madame Le Prince de Beaumont. Summary A fantasy in which a household drudge is delivered into the hands of a monster who falls in love with her and is eventually revealed as a handsome prince. Credits Director of Production Emile Darbon Director Story Dialogue Jean Cocteau Music Georges Auric Editor Claude Iberia Cast Jean Moret, Josette Day, Marcel Andre, Mila Parly, Nan Germain, Lopert Films, Incorporated, December forty six, LP one seven two two Black Narcissus The Archers Film Productions, London Released in the U.S. by Universal International. Copyright 1948. Presented by J. Arthur Rank. 99 minutes. Sound. Color. 35 millimeter. Based on the novel by Rumor Godden. Summary. A drama about five Anglican nuns who organize a convent school in an abandoned palace in the Himalayan mountains. They experience loneliness and ultimate failure in attempting to cope with ignorance, delinquency, cynicism, and human passions. Credits Produced, directed, and written by Michael Powell Emmerich Pressburger Editor Reginald Mills Music Brian Easdell Cast Deborah Carr Sabu David Farrar Flora Robson, Esmond Knight Applied Author, Universal Pictures Co. Incorporated Independent Producers Limited, 3 June 48, LP 1925 A Double Life, Universal Pictures Company, Incorporated Copyright 1948 103 minutes sound black and white 35 millimeter a Canon production Summary reality 
and illusion become indistinguishable in the mind of an actor playing the part of Othello. After strangling an off-stage sweetheart, he returns to the theater and stabs himself fatally during a performance. Credits Producer, Michael Kanan Director, George Cukor Script, Ruth Gordon, Garson Kanan Music, Miklos Rosa Film Editor, Robert Parrish Cast, Ronald Coleman Signe Hasso, Edmund O'Brien, Shelley Winters, Ray Collins. Universal Pictures Co. Incorporated and Canon Productions, 8 March 48, LP 1706. I Remember Mama, RKO Radio Pictures Incorporated, copyright 1948, presented by Dor Sherry. 134 minutes, sound, black and white, 35 millimeter, based on the play adapted by John Van Druten from the novel Mama's Bank Account by Catherine Forbes, pseudonym of Catherine Anderson McLean. Summary. The experiences of a Norwegian family living in San Francisco in the 1910s. Credits. Executive producer and director George Stevens. Producer, Harriet Parsons. Screenplay, DeWitt Bodine. Music score, Roy Webb. Music director, C. Bakalenkov. Film editor, Robert Swink. Cast, Irene Dunn, Barbara Bel Geddes, Oscar Homolka, Philip Dorn, Sir Cedric Hardwick. RKO Radio Pictures Incorporated, 11 March 48, LP 1606. In the Good Old Summer Time, Lowe's Incorporated, copyright 1949, 103 minutes, sound, color, 35 millimeter, an MGM picture, a new version of the 1940 motion picture the Shop Around the Corner, based on a play by Miklos Laszlo. Summary. A musical comedy about two mail-order lovers who unknowingly work in the same office. Setting, Chicago at the turn of the century. Credits. Producer, Joe Pasternak. Director, Robert Z. Leonard. Screenplay, Samson Rafelson. Adaptation, Albert Hackett, Francis Goodrich, Ivan Tours. Music Director, Georgie Stoll. Film Editor, Adrian Fazan. Cast, Judy Garland, Van Johnson, S.Z. Cuddles Sakal, Spring Byington, Clinton Sundberg. Lowe's Incorporated, 23 June 49, LP 2370. Key Largo, Warner Brothers Pictures, Incorporated, copyright 1948, 101 minutes, sound, black and white, 35 millimeter, based on the play by Maxwell Anderson. Summary: A cynical young army officer arrives by chance on Key Largo, off the coast of Florida. He aligns himself on the side of law and order when he finds that the island is the rendezvous of a gang of counterfeiters. Credits. Producer, Jerry Wald. Director, John Houston. Screenplay, Richard Brooks, John Houston. Music, Max Steiner. Orchestrations, Murray Cutter. Film editor, Rudy Fair. Cast, Humphrey Bogart, Edward G. Robinson, Lauren Bacall, Lionel Barrymore, Claire Trevor. Warner Brothers Pictures Incorporated, 31 July 48, LP 1750. The Pale Face, Paramount Pictures Incorporated, copyright 1948, 91 minutes, sound, black and white, 35 millimeter. Summary. A burlesque of the horse opera, 
a timid traveling dentist mistaken for a federal agent despite gun duels and an attempted burning at the stake escapes the indians on the warpath outwits the outlaws and wins the love of a gun-toting cowgirl credits producer robert l welch director norman z mccloyd original screenplay edmund hartman frank tashlin music score victor young editor ellsworth hoagland cast bob hope jane russell robert armstrong iris adrian robert watson paramount pictures incorporated 24 december 48 lp 2183 the paradigm case vanguard films incorporated copyright 1947 132 minutes sound black and white 35 millimeter based on robert hitchens novel summary a melodrama in which a famous lawyer becomes infatuated with his client a woman accused of murdering her blind husband glimpses of gay luxurious living contrast with the principal setting a courtroom in old bailey london credits producer david o selznick director alfred hitchcock screenplay david o selznick adaptation alma raville music franz waxman film editor hal c kern cast gregory peck ann todd charles lawton charles coburn ethel barrymore vanguard films incorporated 27 december 47 lp 1489 the velvet touch independent artists limited copyright 1948 97 minutes sound black and white 35 millimeter summary when valerie stanton an actress strikes her bullying producer a single blow with a metal statuette he falls dead at her feet thereafter valerie's tortured conscience gives her no peace and she confesses to the police in the moment of her greatest triumph credits producer frederick brisson director john gage story william mercer annabel ross screenplay leo roston adaptation walter riley music director c bakalenikoff music score lee harlein film editor chandler house cast rosalind russell leo jen claire trevor sydney greenstreet leon ames independent artists limited four august forty eight lp one seven six two end of ten great films of the late forties by library of congress copyright office